In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Praise be Jesus Christ. The Russian Doll Catechism. Jesus and man, man and the church, the church in heaven. Question. Which are the sacraments that give sanctifying grace? The sacraments that give sanctifying grace are baptism and penance, and they are called sacraments of the dead. Why, question, why are baptism and penance called sacraments of the dead? Baptism and penance are called sacraments of the dead because they take away sin, which is the death of the soul, and give grace, which is its life. The Blessed Trinity is undivided. God the Father, God the Son, and God the Holy Spirit are always present when any one person of the Trinity is present. At baptism, the Holy Spirit dwells in your soul, which means the Father and the Son dwell in your soul. God's very life, sanctifying grace, dwells in your soul. All seven sacraments either give, restore, or increase grace in your soul. Through baptism, we possess sanctifying grace. Through penance, we recover it if it has been lost. Jesus is God and gives his life through sacraments. He gave sacraments to the church. The church gives sacraments to you. Again, grace from sacraments, sacraments from the church, the church from Jesus, Jesus from God the Father. Question, what is baptism? Baptism is a sacrament which cleanses us from original sin, makes us Christians, children of God, and heirs of heaven. Original sin leads to death. Sanctifying grace leads to life. Question, how many things are necessary to make a sin mortal? To make a sin mortal, three things are necessary. A grievous matter, sufficient reflection, and full consent of the will. Question, why is this sin called mortal? This sin is called mortal because it deprives us of spiritual life, which is sanctifying grace, and brings everlasting death and damnation on the soul. After baptism, we are cleansed of original sin, Christians, children of God, and heirs to heaven. After one mortal sin, we are deprived of sanctifying grace, deprived of union with the church, and have everlasting death and damnation. Question, what is hell? Hell is a state to which the wicked are condemned and in which they are deprived of the sight of God for all eternity and are in dreadful torments. Question, how does the sacrament of penance remit sin and restore the soul, the friendship of God? The sacrament of penance remits sin and restores the friendship of God to the soul by means of the absolution of the priest. Confession remits sin, restores friendship of God, makes us again now heirs to heaven. The Russian Doll Catechism, commentary by Matthew Gill, illustration by Sebastian Gill. Question and answers are taken from Baltimore Catechism number two and the Catechism of the Catholic Church. More information, please go to linktoliturgy.com. Subscribe and like this YouTube channel where there are other videos on the Russian Doll Catechism. And if you would like a digital copy of this, either to print your own booklet out or to get a PDF digitally, please go to linktoliturgy.teachable.com. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit,